Wow, what a morning. Crowded House Friday. We are just absolutely so excited to have you guys here with us. So welcome and thank you. Thank you very much. How do you guys feel? Does it just feel good? You're back together. It does feel good. We're we're um, on the we're only 12 hours in the country, so we're we're also not don't really know what's going on. But that <laughs> feels good sometimes. Friday did morning. You, why you got caught in London? Did you with all the we did, we, stuff. we got involved in a major security alert at, uh, at Heathrow when they saw Nick's hat. <laughs> and I wouldn't take. I refuse to take it off because of religious, you know, reasons. But yeah. Um, Better stuff things up a little. Yeah. It was amazing. We arrived at Heathrow yesterday afternoon to fly out for the second time to try and fly out on our flight. Uh, well, actually, yesterday morning, and the entire there must have been about five thousand people outside Heathrow in the same coloured blankets, and we sort of walked through because the airlines had given them all blankets. They spent the night outside. They weren't yeah. even allowed to sleep yeah. inside the terminal, which was extraordinary. It was like, like a, a refugee camp. Yeah, it was. It was like yeah. a scene out of. Children Where were the of news men. cameras? Yeah, <laughs> Where were they? no. they're here. They're here. Because I tell you what, um, give us the story. I mean, it's eleven years since we all said goodbye, and now we're saying hello again. Tell us the story of, of what prompted you guys to get back together? Uh, well, it, it did um, come from the music, really. Nick and I spent quite a lot of time hanging out uh, from sort of late the year, year before last um, and hadn't seen a lot of each other and we just inevitably picked up guitars and started making music together and it was going to be a week or two maybe having Nick down and doing some playing on my new record and it turned into most of the year he was hanging out and he was sitting his easel up off the side of the... Of the um, the control room while I was doing guitar overdubs and tended to be painting. <laughs> and, uh, you know, before you knew it, it just felt like I, I was in a band again. It felt to Nick like it was a band again. And, and what's more, I think the music ended up sounding like a band again. So yeah. we, we drew and came into it sort of naturally. It's Paul, inevitable. Yeah, Paul's death mm -hmm. affected everyone in the music industry, fans and everyone in the industry. Did that have an impact? You've dedicated the album to, to Paul Hester. Did you, did you think, guys, life's, life's too short? We, Let's do what we love doing. That's pretty good, yeah. That's a pretty good uh, uh, overview. I mean, the album is called Time on Earth, and uh, it's about seizing the day, making sure that you, uh, you know, you realise what are dear, the, 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 the bonds that are dear to you, you know. Yeah. yeah. It's a the great val message. valuable things and hold on to them in a year, because, you know, as we, we know only too acutely, they may not be there next yeah. day. So that's been a spur, but I think just reconnecting, re reconnecting and uh, discovering that the the sort of bond that was Crowded House is a bit stronger than any of us kind of uh, gave it credit for, maybe. Yeah. Are you amazed at the feedback, how loved this band was well, it's, and, it's, it is, and is again? It you're, is you're all good. Well, we've, we've received no real sort of sceptical or cynical... Uh, surprisingly, mind you, I haven't been reading... I stay away from the internet, so I, I just don't look at blogs, but, you know, because... You never know what you're going to read, but uh, no, it's been pretty positive all round. Oh, yeah. Yeah. We had an email a little bit earlier. Eleanor in Tasmania has, uh, has written in saying she's sitting at home watching you guys. She's got tears in her eyes. These guys are cheering. <laughs> she's, uh, she's tearing. Who are they cheering? Crying. You. You it's so early in the bloody morning. That's why she's crying. <laughs> Oh, look, it's great to see all ages out there, isn't it, too? Because yeah. there's people who probably didn't get to see Crowded House first time yeah. around, so hopefully this time, you know, it'll be... Uh... Yeah. And now, the and big, big highlight is Live Earth. Yes. How yeah. important is that to you guys, the whole message that Live Earth stands for? Well, it's incredibly timely, obviously, for us to be able to play to a, an open-air audience in, um, in Sydney to come back to Australia in that manner as a kind of bookend to how we left it for, for what we believe is one of, is the most important cause um, out there this year because it affects literally everybody on the planet. Um, so it's a unifying thing and, and for us to turn up and play at an event like this is kind of a privilege. It's, it's the least we can do but it's also great to have some small role in the whole thing. Yeah, yeah. fantastic. Can I ask too, do you know what sort of tomorrow and the next day will bring or are you making it up as you go along? Are we going to see more than one album? You're touring a little bit later on this year. Do you know, sort of... You're well, since, since we've, see we've gotten guys? Matt, Matt Sherrod playing drums with us... Yeah, uh, Matt! Hey, hey. Yeah, Mark! Mark up! Not under any pressure, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're probably going to be recording again in January, I'd say, for another album following this, because there's, there's lots of new songs. There's a new energy in the, in the band with such a powerhouse engine yeah. room. Max Shredder, we like to refer to him as. <laughs> and, uh, you know, he's, he's cutting it. He's cutting a fine trouser line. So uh, you're really, really, really back. Yeah. Good. <laughs> really, 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 really back. back. <laughs>
<laughs> well, that's terrific. Thank you for coming in today. Now you've got a few more songs to play we have. later, but really appreciate oh, we your time. We scrapped just about the rest of the show yeah, yeah. for you guys. We, <laughs> we, said, we said Hang Sunrise. It's a crowded house after Good this. on you. You're quite tall, you guys, aren't you? <laughs> yeah, we <laughs> yeah, look at a bit on TV. Really <laughs> <Neil>. Don't you <laughs> look tall together? <laughs> or is it just we look taller on no, TV? No, we look shorter on TV. It's cruel, the camera. Now, the single is called Don't Stop Now. It's from the new album, Time on Earth. You can find both of them in stores now. Plus, tickets for their national tour, speaking of the national tour, go on sale today right around the country. Let me tell you, better be quick. Crowded House will be back to perform three more songs later in the show. Thank you, guys. Fabulous. We really, really appreciate it. That's right. Also, we had the push to ban plastic shopping bags by 2009. We'll ask whether it can work. And is tomorrow the luckiest day of the century? For next year's sport and weather, all together you're watching Sunrise on Crowded House Friday. Thanks for joining us. Hey, thanks, Sunrise. We so miss Crowded House. Who loved Crowded House? Yeah! Oh, it's so they just picked up where they left off. The sound is just, as soon as you hear it, you're like, there yeah, they are again. It is we missed them. I can't believe it was 11 years. Very exciting day. Good this is, morning. This is going to be a tough act to follow, uh, Crowded House. So thanks, guys, for setting it up for us. Oh, how good is it, though? Oh, we're, we're all up there on the balcony, the morning show balcony. Yay! Yeah. Lighting candles. We're coming a little bit late getting down here this morning. Yeah. All right, as you said, Crowded House performing this morning. We've got three more songs coming up. We couldn't have them in and just do one no. or two. No, four they're doing, so one down, three to go. And, uh, and of course, they're performing in Australia for the first time in over a decade. It's We're a bit of history, excited. isn't it? We feel really, really honoured that they're here. We said, we said to them during the commercial break, do you realise how big a deal this is? It is uh, for fans, their past and new ones. It is just fantastic, yeah. isn't it? No. It's just, just as soon as you hear their sound, it's just yesterday. Nessie and Tony, though, you can't get bigger fans than this. We played message to my girl at my husband's request at our wedding. When we signed the register, we played Fall to Your Feet. And when we walked into the reception, and uh, we played Don't Dream It's Over. So it is our sixth wedding anniversary. <laughs> oh, <laughs> nicely read. Come on, you missed all that work. <laughs> Have a good day. Oh, three more songs coming up this morning. Don't you worry, we've, uh, we've got a crowded house here this morning. It's six past eight. Let's get another check of the weather from Monique. Hello again. Hello. Well, a little bit of crowded house trivia for you. When Paul McCartney was interviewed, he was, he was asked what it felt like to be the world's best songwriter of all time. And he answered, I'm not Neil Finn is. Wow. How cool is that? Mm. And apparently when it was put to Neil Finn, um, he just nodded and went, oh, wow, <laughs> very <laughs> modest. And somebody just said to me that I was the, the personification of Crowded House because I'm half New Zealander and half Australian, although these guys would argue with me, eh? Yes. You're New Zealanders, eh? Yeah. Yeah? yeah. And so, but you, you don't, you won't agree that they're half, half Australian, half no, New no, Zealand? No, 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 they're Kiwi beans. They're yeah. full-blooded New Zealanders. <laughs> okay, are they Australian or Kiwi? Aussie. Oh. Yeah. Aussie. <laughs> Let's yeah. start back. I know. It gets very difficult. Oh, yeah. You guys have come all the way from Perth. Yes, yeah. we have. So when did you arrive? Um, last night, about one. And you are you both equally big fans, mother and daughter? Um, Maybe <laughs> daughter. I like her, but she loves them. Yeah. <laughs> and you've had a little bit of a reunion because they came they came around here and this lady said, Oh, I know you from Woolies in Perth. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. Oh, nice. Yeah, nice. All right, let's have a look at the weather around Australia.